I grow up, I like to become an IPS officer and that is my aim. I never gave up my goal in any challenges in my life because my aim is only that I have to reach the goal in any way also. My difficult subject is chemistry. From that, I was not understanding it by reading itself. So I, when I started a STEM project, I, I started learning it more easily. This made me to understand more easy by doing the experiments. I have learned chemistry, the reactions of acids and bases and salt in very easy way. When I grow up, my dream is to become an IAS officer. It is scientifically proved that children learn more by seeing uh, rather than reading. So by this CLT classes or e Shala, it is very useful that we see it will be always in our mind and if in a uh, difficult situation that picture comes into our mind and we can write uh, very uh, cleanly and with great words, with great experience. When we started our Vidya Jyoti program to transform education in the rural schools near the line of control, Jammu, the first problem we encountered is the capability of the teachers. We wanted to transform the classroom experience both for the teachers as well as the kids. And the first thing that came to our mind is CLT's e Patashale kit. It has the right pedagogy, very easy to deploy and a very, very intuitive user interface. Its extensive coverage of the concepts in NCRD syllabus makes it very, very immersive for the students in every classroom session. CLT uh, developed a very interesting proposition for STEM teaching, that is a science and maths uh, teaching in schools. The challenge that they overcame was there was a shortage of teachers, in some case lack of ability of teachers. Second, many of the solutions that were there at that point of time were internet based uh, solutions and they were not applicable because of connectivity in schools. So they found a way of how to give local solutions for local uh, classrooms. At a time when EdTech is making its way to private schools, CLT India, through its initiative e Patrale, is ensuring that the same transformation is taking place in the most remote Indian classrooms. Voice is a form of a verb. Active voice and passive voice. Eight is the active voice. The vast was broken. This is an example of passive voice. Epart Charlie's learning labs have adopted experiential pedagogical methods for critical subjects like science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, popularly known as STEM. Groundwater has an important source of water. Groundwater fills the spaces between soil particles and fractured rock beneath the earth's surface. CLT India is not only building a rich educational environment in the country, but is also empowering school students to realize their dreams and aspirations. The vision of our organization is to give access to quality education for all children. So, the first one was actually cracking what's the right kind of pedagogy for STEM, for the rural schools. The second one was localization of this particular content and that happening in regional languages. Third one was having a low cost technology delivery model. So this entire um, system of uh, repository of content could reach the remote schools. And the fourth one was, and we call it like a 4D equation is for the data analytics that would come real time from every single location to the dashboard. I would like to acknowledge um, two particular collaborations. Uh, we were very lucky, we were spotted by FIKI for the Millennium Alliance Award and we won the uh, Low Cost Innovation Award in the first round, which, which also gave us some seed funding that helped us to streamline and strengthen our idea Secondly, at the state level, we needed a partner that supported us from the beginning till now. Karnataka, we have been able to scale the farthest, about 10,000 plus classrooms because mainly of one partnership. There are other additional people, 
but Menda Foundation came to us from the very beginning with the infrastructure support. The students uh, first they are seeing the video and uh, they are making some notes on that uh, uh, video demonstration and uh, based on that uh, video uh, the students will be uh, easily they were uh, solving the problems in the classroom. So uh, this syllabus is also a same as NCRT, CBSE, it's our, all are mixing, all syllabus are mixing. But uh, the way of teaching is uh, very good in this uh, CLT syllabus, I mean syllabus means uh, the videos. The word tense comes from the Latin word tempus, it came from the Latin word tempus. CLT India's ability to design and develop a large repository of STEM content in multiple regional languages has touched the lives of 1.8 million students across 12,000 classrooms in 10 states of India. The main reason for its widespread acceptance is the low-cost technology delivery model it has adopted for its EPAR Charlie platform, which is not dependent on the internet. Today, this program can reach a student at five rupees a month uh, for at least a three-year program. The, to me personally, the victory has been that the students are more engaged in the classroom. They're able to recollect and recapitulate. Uh, science and mathematics concepts better, they're able to score better. Uh, in terms of teachers, they're spending their time mediating between their system uh, and speaking to um, uh, students. We are taking the Iparchala program beyond the classroom today and now it is in, available uh, for students and teachers over Android apps. In fact, our Jiggy app for teachers is uh, seed funded by MoneyGram Foundation. We are aiming to take this to 100,000 teachers over the next two years.